Hello, everybody, and welcome back to Benjamin Magnus Plays. European River Salus 4, last episode, Spain attacked in Central America to beat them. And they uh, did basically nothing in the peace deal. And then the United Kingdom attacked in Mexico. And we're fighting this war, and I can bet you anything that the AI is basically going to do nothing in the peace deal. It's a little frustrating. I feel like, considering they're my tributary state, that I should be able to actually handle the the uh, the war um, the war score at the end. Uh, I, I, it feels a little weird. Tributaries I, I, are, are they're a subject subject state, so I'm not sure why they're the war leader and not me. Because in any other su instance with a subject state, I would be the war leader, not them. Oh, Shiza, twenty on thirty. Do we have any other ships in the region? Can help out. Oh, we did apparently. No, uh, Australia did. Go, Australia! Australia, you guys are awesome. I fucking love you, Australia. Not that I didn't already, you know, like, pre-existing love fucking Australians. I worked with, I got to meet a lot of cool people from a lot of places when I worked at Disney. That's one good thing about working at Disney. You get to meet some really awesome people. Uh, and I, I can, I can hands down say every single Australian or Kiwi that I met, I fucking loved. So I can't even see what's going on. Oh, you know, that's occupied territory. So many conversions. I definitely am grabbing religious next. I can't get there. Okay. Multiple wars. We're doing a f we're doing fine though. Oh, that one just went down. Definitely trying to save up, but constant. Oh, and there it is. Constantly dumping points into uh, development just because I don't have anything to do with it. These guys aren't actually interested in fighting me, which I'm fine with. I guess I'm, all I'm going to do is take your shit. And now we've got their, their fucking peasants. This, that's exactly what I thought was going to happen, was that we were going to siege all this stuff down and then we're going to end up fighting their peasants. Oh, right. apparently I lost an, uh, this this leader as well. I, I find it very peculiar that you can uh, lose so many leaders across the entire planet all in one go from a coup. The guys fighting through uh, Canada was involved in the coup that took place back home. Sure it did. Sure it did. The hell's my goddamn fleet? And why is it taking so long to get up? What were you doing over there? Ah. Okay, asshole. Maybe I told him to go to the other side and I didn't realize it or something. So taking their capital will get me most of the war score I need here. And yep, they're not interested in fighting. <clears throat> Man. Well, you know what? This is multiple colonies is what's going on. High naval attrition. Oh, one guy's at zero? That's interesting. Oh, it ended. Okay, let's see what they did. 10% of their income. War reps. They did nothing but money. Nothing but money. Oh, it hurts so much when you do that. All they did was force them to give them a little bit of cash. Oh, man. That, that's painful. That is painful. Fight, I fought Spain, Portugal, and England and got nothing out of it.
That's a tough pill to swallow. Have we even fought a battle yet? I don't think we have. Just taking their land now. That's why you never leave anything up to the AI. Because it's not going to do... You know, if, if it was me, I would have dismantled their shit. I would have taken them to... I would have taken them apart. I would have, I would have taken them I would have taken them apart and I would have dismantled their colonies and and taken the sh their shit that they got over here I would have taken a lot but unfortunately that's not how it works got a little bit more of the map though right I really want to transport like 80,000 men to England. We never built any uh, 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 galleys because we're basically an ocean faring race of people here. Should we, should we just peace out now? Because they're probably going to start erupting soon. So we're going to take this. And then just nibble up the coastline here. See what's going to happen if we run out of war score or we hit overextension. That's what I wanted. That's what I talked about taking. Take their goddamn capital. There we go. Yeah, that's fine. Only lost 48,000 men to attrition. Didn't fight a single battle. Not a single battle was fought in that war. That's a lot of a lot of low dev provinces is what that was. Great Britain. And their army is way stronger than mine. But what we we got we gotta do what we gotta do. Okay, so that means going over here. Uh, diplomacy. Uh, economic. We don't have any Guys available? No, we do not. So we are going to... Oh, we cannot issue embargo against someone. We have a truce. Okay. Trading in silk. Max promoted cultures. Oh, we lost that. But we still have a promoted culture. Ha 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 ha! So many things. All of the stuff. Boom. Boom. To have a colonist out. Do it. That'll get me a border with Russia, who's sieged down like a motherfucker. Just start crawling across Scandaria. What's going on over here? Oh, the trees are poking through. Let's see, what does it look like now? 58%. Well, it all needs to be cord still. Ethiopia's got power over here. Alright, so... 10, 8, 10. What is our focus now? Military, let's focus on admin. So we can get that quicker. Fucking religious. It's too much shit to convert. We're, we're expanding so fast. Oh, these guys, I want to kill them too. Uh, my, my navy's over here. You know what would be useful? Is building an entire another navy over here. Uh, of tra Just transports, just transports. Well, for starters, let's get you back up to 20. You lost some ships. And then we'll go ships. Uh, East Indian men. 
We'll just go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one. 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, 41, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46. That's what I'm going to do. A little bit extra. A little wiggle room is what we're talking about. Because we got this navy over here. Oh, we captured a couple ships. Got this navy sitting over here busy. Constantly busy. Two armies over, over in the Americas now because there's so much conflict over there. We're going to take all this stuff. What I, what I plan on doing is attacking Russia. When I... Ooh, there we go. Is attacking Russia... And just, oh, whoa, what's going on? Persia, Korea, Ming's attacking them. That's what's going on. Scandinavia, the Ottomans, and Ming are all attacking them right now. Oh, Russia, you, you, you done. You, you done, son. Russian, but looks like they ate Estonia. These shipyards are going to be very, very useful for my navy. Make sure we got all the best trade doodles. Oh, production. Ah, there's some nice ones in there again. Taxation. Nothing too special. 45. Johor and Malacca. Down here. Oh, that was a little one and a big one. We're going to send both armies together to, to mitigate the casualties. Commandant died. Alrighty, so that's you. Morale of armies, 10%. My morale is... My morale was four... Almost... Four points. I think it was actually exactly four points higher than, uh, sp like the Spanish colonial morales. It, that was fucking brutal. I don't think I've ever seen a difference that big before. Alright, so we are gonna go over here. Hit them before they have a chance to actually do that. Good. And you move over here. You move back up there. This stuff's gonna get cored. This should jump. Quite a lot once we have it all cored up and in states. Although I don't know what how many can I? Let's go to my government. We're a show can't change government type, right? Can't change that. Cannot change that. Oh, the ship! Oh, lots of ship construction still. All right, you back up here to like near Bali. Oh, we have a lot of these transports done, so... So I'll just grab them. And move them here. Then you stay there. Definitely needed another fleet of transports. Definitely needed that. Something I've been neglecting to do for quite a while now, but I'm, it's not like I can't fucking aff afford it. Five. Oh, we got lights in there. We got to grab some lights too. It's not. It's not my full, full contingent. We got more coming. All right, let's get. Let's let's do do it with what we got. Yeah, you know what? I think I just told. Pretty sure it just told the other fleet to go handle this because it's bigger. 34. So where are the other ones coming from? Oh, they're, they're almost done. All 
I might have counted wrong. East Timor again. You sons of bitches. I need 40, 40, 40 transports. Should have enough. I thought I counted 46. I hope I counted 46. Sunni Zealots. Up to 38. 39. 40. That's 40 right there, so that'll do it. May have counted wrong. There we go. Better. And we'll take those uh, lights out while we get the, when we have the chance, and then we'll we'll send these guys up north. Oh wait, we got we got some of the, something else to take care of first. But we got colonists, free colonists. Uh. Oh, this is this is a working colony. That's why. All right, so send those guys out. Just take in Siberia, because what the fuck else am I gonna do with these guys? Any other singles sitting out here? Yes, there are. Right down here. Should probably give them some heavies to work with, too, as a... Uh... Kind of defensive force, just in case. Missionary! Alrighty. Got another one out. Two. That'll help. Take the prestige hit, not a big deal for me. Attacked by pirates, but that's okay. I mean, I just throw money. I throw money around left and right. Shoshone, they are huge. Allied with the Arapoho. Paho? I don't think I've seen a native tribe really get that big before. Coring's nearly done. Got 35% control of Siam now, probably because mostly from that. But that means all that stuff's just pouring straight down this way. And let's merge. Then we're going to take a look at you. We're going to go like this. We're going to, hey, 20 of you guys select protect trade in Malacca. Right here. You guys are needed up here. I cannot believe everybody's picking on uh, Russia like this. I think it's a little funny. But Russia's, I can't tell if Russia's been at war with uh, the Ottomans and Scandinavia multiple times or just once really badly. Whew. Spain's moving on Tunis. I'm loving what's going on up in here. Loving it. Columbia. Let's take a look at my. Uh, let's see, Australia because they got they had a huge modifier. Colombia, it's already high at Colombia. So, okay, local rulers. Yeah, because they send me a good amount. Keep them appeased. Call construction. Get uh can get there easy. Let's see, visiting a shrine. Take the prestige. Send that guy out. This is actually going really fast. Because a uh, base of 140 can actually, I can actually get it higher than that too. Base 140 is really high. When you first start, if you take, uh, you can get it, you, your base can be like as low as 10. Actually, I'm gonna go through here and just double this. And there's, that's not that fleet. Um, actually, well, why not? Go up to 50. 
That's that one. They made it. This is the one in Beijing. I'm gonna I'm gonna up this one to 80. Oh, I feel a little bad about what I did to Ultra Hill in the multiplayer series. Sent like I think I sent over 200 light ships to Privateer in his uh in his his home node. Basically, like like in an instant, I can snatch 60% of his income or something like that. And then he declared war on me. And if you haven't been watching the multiplayer, it's it's fun. I've never engaged in economic warfare on on that scale before, but it was it was very interesting. We have uh, there are uh, rebels that are going to pop, but frankly, I can handle them. Same continent subjects. That's kind of a a, a son of a bitch, considering oh, that would be only Australia, if that. Artillery back row damage is going to be awesome. That one would be good. Artillery bonus versus forts plus three is pretty cool if you could stack like 80 cannons on a fort. KC just finished. I'm going to split. This one right there. This one is just going to go right down there. Gonna go right down. Just, just go to the tip. Just to the, just to the tip. That was another revolt. Yep, right over here, but we can grab that. No problem. Rebels are easy. Easy as can be. This is going to be mostly just attrition and sieges. Lo lots of lots of space to uh, occupy, basically. And by that, I mean the, the travel distance. It takes a long time to walk from, one, from point A to point B. Diplo annex cost? That means nothing to me right now. We're not Diplo annexing anyone. Doing a lot of construction these days. Trade power. Couple of those guys. Keep a couple couple thou in the bank. And what I could do is build the Panama. I own the no, I don't own the Panama Canal zone. My colony does, so I don't think I have a access to that option. No, I do. I could build the Panama Canal. Fuck, yeah, save that. I need t dip, uh, text. It was admin tech 26. Oh, we have it. So, yeah, let's just save that shit up. Let's save up our money and build the Panama fucking canal. You mine. Nope, I'm, I'm going to 100% just for shits and giggles. Native assimilation. And... Do, 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 you have any money? I'll take it. I'm building that canal. Oh, that looks so much better. Done it. Done that look better. <laughs> Bring this up to 50. Man, the Antilles really wants me to help them out. We could keep going, too. How's, how's, how you doing, Russia? Oh, man, Russia. Everybody hates Russia. Everybody hates Russia. Uh, Scandinavia, the Ottomans, the Persians, and the Chinese just keep smashing them. And this is filled in, but the trees are overlapping, so it doesn't look as pretty. Sadly. Land maintenance modifier. Gain a grand captain. Okay. That's fine. It's a very, it's a very nice swath of Siberia. I can't wait to fight the Chinese. It's gonna be a slaughter. I think I need to take quantity ideas if I'm gonna fight the con the, the Chinese though. And that'd be, you know, that's the last thing I can take. No, we're, we're saving up thir 30,000 is what we're doing. We're saving that up. All right, what do we got up here? Liberty desire from subject development. Boom, that's a good one. 
because that's going to drive everybody's desire lower, especially Mexico. Yeah, they're all perfectly loyal. The Shawnee in Sardinia. Oh, I wonder if anybody, did anybody else pick up on that? They were released as my subjects is what they were, it was what happened there. Pomerania. So Sardinia is mine. <laughs> oh, and we maxed out on Diplo again. Papuan. Oh, that's it. Six spent six points. Ooh, we could increase our mercantilism. Mercantilism? Do it a lot. All right, what are we looking at? So we're up to 64% trade power here. 75 ducats we earn from this trade node. Who are you? Why are you angry? Oh, yeah, you're those guys. Okay, that's fine. Here, um... We'll put these guys back together and then we'll send them down to crush. No, you can do it with 20,000. Here, do, do this. Right over there. Right over there. And you, when can I fight you again? March of ooh, seven years from now. I mean, we're running out of time in the game. There's less than 100 years left. I, I'm a great power. Oh, I am the greatest power. Let's see, what is Ming? Let's take a look at Ming's military. <laughs> Holy shit! They've got half a million men in the fields and a force limit of 658. Woo! That's a few. That's a little bit more than I expected, guys. Native assimilation, huzzah. Where's my colonial doodles? So they're all going. Does it auto-explore the ones next to you after you colonize it? I thought it did. Ooh, nice. <laughs> Yay, it filled out properly. Oh, that's beautiful. That looks so much... <laughs> uh, trading in fish. I don't think I've ever seen that happen before. Something that common across the world, like... Colombia just declared war on the Antilles for reconquista, reconquest. So who'd you drag in? Just the Antilles. Okay, so yeah, this stuff has changed hands quite a lot. British Brazil wants me to fight with them against the British. At exactly 80. 80 transports. Definitely would need more than that. Stability cost modifier, that's not a big deal. The well, one I need is, uh, it's up here somewhere. Mercenary strength versus heretics. And just straight missionary strength is the next one. That, that one's a great one. Come on, where's our damn doodles? There they are. Go get them. Okay, nice. As much as I want to fight China, I don't know if that's fucking possible. They got half a million men in the field. In the field. That's, that's insanity. 500,000 men. Oh, Russia. Oh, my God, Russia. 
Oh, you're dying. I was planning on gobbling them up, but they're fucking dying. They're dying fast. Australia, you are like my favorite pet. Like the Spanish. Or the Portuguese. Nobody likes you guys. That's not a half bad idea. <laughs> I can take their capital, I bet. Yeah, why don't let's let's stir the pot, why don't we? Let's stir the goddamn pot, guys. This is gonna be interesting. Uh, taking land from California, love that idea. Let's make sure all of our guys are set to siege any forts and avoid battles. Uh, just put them on aggressive. All right, uh, but that is my cell phone. Hang on. Sorry about that smash cut. Uh, we are in the process of transporting our our armies to mainland Europe for the first time. Uh, there is uh, 78,000 screaming Japanese um, and ready to invade Lisbon. Uh, I'm gonna let my my little minions invade California here. Alaska? Yeah, you're fine. You're fine. And I think it should be we should be fine to do that. And I think what we'll do is we'll land our army. Oh, wow, they got over there really fast. Oh, we're actually engaged in some combat. Who's who's over here? Oh, it's nothing big. Not they didn't even touch us. Look at my morale. And we're going to we're going to land a massive army in in uh in Porto. We are going to take the amphibious uh, landing penalty. No big deal there. Because, fuck it, look at that. Look at that. I am going to, even though it's going to go f fast, I'm going to pay to have it done quicker so that we have a port ASAP for our, our guys here. We just bombarded their wall. Oh my god, and it's over. Alright, we're gonna split this. Put you there. You're gonna get your, your leader back. You're gonna go over here. Holy shit. That was fast. We might just run this episode a little long because I'm having so much fun right now. Cork, cork, cord. But nah, nah, we'll, we'll, let, we'll leave it right here. Thank you for watching, everybody. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe if you have been enjoying this series, and I will see all of you next time.